Hello shooters, a short video just about AR magazines. These, uh, This uh, Lancer AWM mag, L5, this is obviously a P mag, USGI mag. Uh, I get emails periodically saying, hey uh, TI, what, what mags do you use? I use all three of these. Uh, they've been uh, tested uh, extensively by uh, uh, organizations and a, a ton of people. So let's just talk about the strategy of buying AR magazines. Okay, uh, all three of these are good to go. I have, obviously, I have all three. Um, I prefer these two just because um, they're lighter. Uh, they don't, you know, they, they won't bend when I drop them. This can bend if you drop it on rocks. It'll bend the feed lips. Um, these are known to be 100% reliable. There's some of these that aren't 100% reliable. You got to kind of test your USGI mags. If they're all brand new, like from Brown Owls or something, you're good to go. If you get them from the used market, you got to test them because they may be bad. Uh, but but let's just talk about long-term strategy for magazines. I'm not sure how long this magazine will last. It's plastic. It may last 100 years. But I want my magazines to last 100 years. Who knows what the situation is going to be like for my grandkids, my great-grandkids, my great-great-grandkids. They may not be able to buy magazines anymore. I know this magazine will be here in a hundred years. I don't know about these two. We haven't had them around for a hundred years to check. Um, however, uh, for for my purposes, I like these two mags, and this is I really like this Lancer mag. I think it's kind of the best of both worlds. It's got the metal feed lifts. It's got the plastic body. I like the translucent body. I also have some that aren't translucent. But anyhow, I guess the bottom line is with AR magazines. I, I, I kind of look at it like the like they say the stock market. You know, you're supposed to diversify. Like I know what the stock market. I don't. You know, but anyway, that's what they say. I think you got to do the same thing with AR mags. I think you got to diversify. I think you got to have some uh, USGI mags. I'd buy them new where I you if you're going to use them for long-term storage. Like from Brown Brownells makes an excellent AR-15 uh, aluminum magazine. Then I'd get some P mags and I get some Lancer mags. If you don't want to get both, I would get the Lancer over the P mag. So if you just wanted to get your your uh, your inventory down to two different types, these are the two. If you want to di diversify a little bit more, um, you know, add add some P mags into the mix. Anyhow, those are my thoughts on uh, AR-15 magazines and the strategies for uh, short term, which these I think this is the shortest term, and then this is like the midterm, and these will you know be around a long, 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 long time as long as your gun will be. Anyhow, hope you enjoy the video. Um, if you like my videos, please uh, share, subscribe, like. Uh, appreciate it. Appreciate all the, uh, the likes. And if you have any questions, please ask them below. Thanks. Have a good day.